Hi Sagittarius, welcome to your mid-month reading. As always, keep in mind that this is only a channel reading. Always check what it feels right and with what does resonate with your own life experiences during this time. If you would like to have a personal reading with me, please contact me through the email I put in the description box below where you can find the current list of reading services I offer. And if you'd like to donate and support my channel, you can also do that by following the PayPal link, which is also down below. So Sagittarius, I'll be channeling messages for the collective of your sign and then we'll tie it together with the cards that will be showing up. So Sagittarius for mid-February. I feel like some of you are taking certain step backs, like you need to maybe slow down or review, reassess situations that you thought you were ready, that you thought you were convinced upon, that you thought were the good things for you. I just feel like you're putting a stop and really analyzing and looking at the situations, trying to understand if they are the ones that are right for you, if they are the ones that you want to be associated with. There's a lot of questions upon things you were doing or certain of so there's doubts questions indecision coming and almost like coming out of the blue uh, i feel like there's a level of questioning that you were not expecting that is triggering some anxiety here for sagittarius because you've given here some sort of commitment or you've given your word towards something that now you are uncertain of. So you could be evaluating a lot of your contracts, commitments, responsibilities, things that bind you to something or someone else. Especially here for Sagittarius that are employed and really unhappy with your work, but you have some sort of contract obligation. This could be uh, giving you a lot to think of, especially like obligations that are like shown that are going to be like for a long period. Your the long term binds are, is something that is worrying you for some reason throughout this time, and for others of you, you could be worried about your own marriage or engagement uh, because I feel like for some of you Sagittarius there's also for some of you this is related to promises promises you've made but that are it's like promises that are now about to become realities where that contract is going to exist and now you're unsure if you're going to sign the deal you are unsure if you're really going to be able to hold the responsibility or to hold the promise you've given uh, you've given so most mostly you are unsure of yourself at this time Sages. so it's a time to review what can be change what can be done um, before it's too late before it becomes impossible to extract yourself from something it's like some of you are feeling under pressure and this pressure is really causing you anxiety as of if you can put up with something long term for other of you others of you Sagittarius you're just in a moment where your responsibilities could be overwhelming and you're looking for a way out an escape something to take your mind off it you could be tempted to want to do things that are more carefree reckless irresponsible just to feel the high of it you could be chasing experiences that give to you, you know, short-term gratification. 
you could be tempted to really put at risk something because unconsciously you don't feel prepared for it so there's a little bit of a sabotaging here pattern where you might set yourself to do things that could damage other things um, without you having to just sit down and express this truth that you might be having second thoughts or you might just have doubts upon what some months ago you were so sure of so you could set you be you could be setting yourself to problems basically because unconsciously if you don't own up to certain truths that are coming right now you will place yourself in situations that will do that for you so I see here some Sagittarius wanting to cheat, wanting to be somehow, how can I say, some Sagittarius want to be in a opposite, really opposite energy of the one you have been in so far. So depending on your current life circumstances, you will figure out what that opposition is. I keep getting, be careful, just be careful with the things you do right now because there's consequences. The point of this time is for you to stop and reflect, is to not overcommit but also to not just drop everything without giving things proper thought. And the difficulty for Sagittarius at this time is to stop and think, stop and reflect, discuss matters, open up about what is worrying you, what is causing you this anxiety. It's about you just owning up to the moment you're in, that it could be really hard for some of you to do. Also, for some, you could be tempted to explore something here of the past. So there could be like a past person or influence coming at this time, creating as well second thoughts and hesitation. Um, some of you Sagittarius could suddenly realize you're not over something or someone you thought you were. And in re relationship-wise, this could be causing some issues. It's like I see situations where suddenly with the six of cups in your soul, you realize you're not over someone or you're not being emotionally loyal to the one you are in the present time, that you're still emotionally attached and connected with someone of your past. For those of you, there's a scenario like this. For others of you, there's just a scenario where you could suddenly realize that you're much more inclined to continue a life or continue to make decisions, to continue to uh, walk down on a path that it's more about how you used to be in that past version of yourself. A past version of yourself some of you miss than the version you've become or the version other people want you to become. It's like realizing you've been somehow pressured or influenced to do things and become this person that does not honor the truth of your soul, that does not is not authentic. So where you have been inauthentic is really gonna be hard to keep up. That fake self, that mask, is going to be hard to keep up because it's almost like life doesn't want you to make a mistake there's a warning here to just be careful because it's like a protection measure from your spirit guides here before you can't go back for some of you Sagittarius it could also be issues related with children or children could be a theme here or a source of pressure. Family responsibilities could be a, give, a big reason as of 
why some of you are holding this masks or not doing things the, the way you want to do them or why you feel like you can't be free because of these responsibilities as a parent or there's a pregnancy for some of you as well coming or taking place that feels like a bind more than a true source of joy unfortunately i see situations like this like situations that is more like an obligation of what is expected to you than of what you really want to do justice hard decisions needing to contemplate needing to stop and reflect and measure everything before you make a decision because with the justice card as what is coming your decisions will be very impactful and you should be making decisions based on what is right what is fair but also what is truth so what is true is the question here some of you will be uncovering what is the deep 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 truth what is the deep 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 truth that you're not living up to that you're not assuming that you're not manifesting because it's in the unconscious the magician so this energy wants to come out this message wants to come out this guidance wants to come out but the filter in which this is being used is a very logical rational center domain so you really will have to be super conscious of everything you do right now to ensure that what you're doing what you're connecting with is based on truth and not on deception or manipulation because in this unconscious the magician might also message here that you've been manipulating the truth or you've been masking and concealing aspects of your nature that now want to come out and play for other of you Sagittarius it's like you have not been in the playful energy there's a lack of playfulness or joy or freedom that life's life wants you to address and explore without it having to be a source of shame or something you need to hide or something you need to be uh, suffering any kind of judgment or consequence for to find ways to find ways to be a part of activities that make you happy things that make you happy in a mature way so you don't go about this in an immature irresponsible direction but you go about this based on reason based on your mental health as a way to protect your own mental and emotional health so i hope you have a great mid-month hopefully we'll see each other soon